A pleasant greetings to all. In this video, I am going to explain how to draw the mechanical network for the mechanical translational system. This is the problem number one. This is the problem number one. Here, I am going to explain how to draw the mechanical network for this mechanical translational system. There are five steps are needed to draw the mechanical network. Step number one. Draw the reference line. Step number 2. Select the nodes corresponding to the displacements x1 and x2. Step number 3. Connect one end of the mass to the reference line. Step number 4. Connect the other elements between node and the reference line. Step number 5. Apply nodal analysis. Step number 6 is apply the Laplace transformation of the equation. Then find out f of s divided by x2 of s. First of all, I am going to explain how to draw the mechanical network. So to draw the mechanical network, what is the step number 1? Step number 1 is draw the reference line. Here this is the step number 1. Then select the nodes corresponding to the displacement x1 and x2. Here two displacements are there. Corresponding to the two displacements, have to select two nodes, that is x1 and x2. x1 that is corresponds to the mass m1. Next, I am going to draw the mass m1. Mass m1 is drawn between reference line and the node. And next, I am going to draw Mass M2. Mass M2 is drawn between reference line and node X2. Between X1 and X2, we are having the spring K1, sorry, K2. And between X2 and the ground or reference, we are having K3. And next, between X1 and reference, we are having K1 and between X1 and the reference, we are having the force F of T. This is the mechanical network. From the mechanical network, first of all, I am going to apply the nodal analysis and then write the nodal equation. Afterwards, I am going to convert the equation in the S domain by applying Laplace transform. Then find f of S by x2 of S. Thus, with respect to node x1, I am going to write the equation. What are the elements connected in the node x1? The elements connected to the node x1 are m1. K and F of T. F of T is the force input. Remaining all the internal forces. How to write? F of T is equal to M1 into D square X1 by DT square plus A1 into X1 plus with respect to X1 I am going to write the equation. So, A2 into X1 minus X2. This is the equation number 1. Next, I am going to find out the equation number 2 corresponding to the node X2. Three elements are connected in the node X2. How to write the equation? All the forces are internal forces only. There is no external force in the node x2. How to write the equation? Start with the mass m2, m2 into d square x2 divided by dt square plus a2 into with respect to x2, I am going to write the equation so x2 minus x1 plus k3 is connected to x2, a3 into x2 equal to 0, equation number 2. 
take the equation number 1 and apply Laplace transformation. The equation 1 becomes f of s equal to m1 into s square into x1 of s plus k1 into x1 of s plus k2 into x1 of s minus k2 into x2 of s. From this, I am going to rearrange f of s, x of x1 of s into m1 s square plus k1 plus k2 minus k2 into x2 of s. Equation number 3. Then apply the Laplace transformation for the equation 2. That is m2 into apply all the initial conditions of 0. m2 into s square into x2 of s plus k2 into x2 of s minus k2 into x1 of s plus k3 into x2 of s equal to 0. Here I am going to find out f of s divided by x2 of s. So from this equation, I am going to find out x1 of s. So I am going to rearrange the equation as x2 of s into m2 s square plus k2 plus k3 equal to k2 into x1 of s. From this, what is x1 of s? x1 of s equal to m2 s square plus k2 plus k3 divided by k2 into x2 of s. Equation number 4. Substitute equation number 4 in equation number 3. Equation number 4 in equation number 3. So what is the equation f of s equal to what is x1 of s that is m2 s square plus k2 plus k3 divided by k2 into already we are having the term m1 s square plus k1 plus k2 into x2 of s minus k2 already there so k2 into x2 of s the next step, I am going to take the LCM. So, K2 square divided by K2. Now, you take X2 of S as common. So, finally, we get the answer F of S divided by X2 of S equal to S square into M2 plus K2 plus K3 into S square into M1 plus K1 plus K2 minus K2 square the whole divided by K2. This is the final equation that is obtained from the mechanical network. Thank you. Have a nice day.